water. It covers 71% of our planet, yet we know more about the surface of the moon than we do about the depths of the world's oceans. Who knows what undiscovered organisms lurk below, waiting to be found amongst the sheets of my bed. <laughs> Today we're going underwater, kind of. We're going to show you the easiest way to make your photos look underwater without having to go underwater. Best of all, we're going to do it using simple household items, no assembly necessary. So bust open a can of dehydrated H2O and let's dive into this. Underwater photography is a particularly expensive niche to break into. While small waterproof cameras have become more affordable in recent years, housings for cameras with interchangeable lenses still carry a hefty price. But for this particular tutorial, you'll just need three simple items. A mouthwash bottle, a lamp, and a plastic sheet protector. The mouthwash bottle will refract the light from the lamp and give it that characteristic aquamarine tone. The plastic sheet protector will soften the image, giving us that slightly blurry underwater look. For this shot, we're going to do a head-on scuba diver portrait. We'll use a screen from the Lovecraft and horror movie Dagon as a reference. Because I don't have a snorkeling mask or a scuba tank, I'll be using some chemistry lab goggles from my university days, along with a measuring cup and some wire piping. Put your camera up on a tripod, set a timer on your shutter, and take the shot. Well, there you go, an easy underwater look if you're on a budget and don't want to expose your gear to the elements. Hope you enjoyed this quick video and stay tuned for more how-to photography content.